Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Teresa, in case you don't know, this is my channel, Just Teresa. Thank you so much for clicking that bell and coming in and checking out my small Dollar Tree haul. I just wanted to show y'all a few of the cute things that I found in the Dollar Tree today. So if you're not connected to me, please do so. I would love if you hit that subscribe button and the bell so you'll know when I'm posting. And don't forget to leave me comments throughout. All my information is in my description box and let's jump right into this haul. I'm gonna start off with the food. Um, Cause I love showing um, when I find good deals, name brand food, because I always go to the Dollar Tree before I go to the grocery store. So that way I can save money. And that's the reason I do these hauls. Okay, first food item that I found, I had to show y'all is by McCormick. And as you know, that is name brand. <laughs> Natural Spices McCormick, McCormick Bourbon Chicken Skillet Sauce. It serves four. You just dump it on top of the chicken in the skillet and you got the best meal. You just add chicken. Look at this, y'all. I got two of those. I had more. I made it last night for me and hubby and it was so, so good. You gotta get these McCormick's because I'm sure in the grocery store, McCormick is probably $4 at least. So they have these. I got two of them. And it says, um, you just heat, heat up the chicken, you know, grill the chicken in the skillet first. And then when it's all cooked thor thoroughly, you dump this sauce on it, let it cook another five minutes, and booyah kasha! <laughs> Not booyah kasha! <laughs> another name brand thing I got to go with that, after we did the chicken and everything, after I did the chicken with the bourbon sauce last night, I did the Minute Maid the Minute Maid, the Minute Rice, which you know is name brand, lightly seasoned garlic and olive oil jasmine rice. Look at this, you guys. I got two of the, two more of these as well. So this was literally our dinner last night and we had chicken in the refrigerator. It's a whole cup. This is just me and my husband here and it was enough for both of us to have a full plate of rice on one so we got a few of them so if, I, if more people were here i could have just threw this in the microwave 90 seconds all you have to do is take this little plastic off 90 seconds and you got garlic and olive oil jasmine rice so good with this get some chicken you got in the house whatever kind you have throw the sauce on put this in the microwave two dollar meal boom you cannot beat it <laughs> I had to show you guys that. Another thing I picked up that I thought was pretty cool, but I picked this up um, a couple of weeks ago, but I just never showed it and I wanted to show it. It's the, the cutest ice tray and it has a cover. Look at this. I love the cover and it has a spout so that you can pour the water in without spilling it all over the place. And if you go on my playlist, you see I made the windy smoothie. And when I, when I was talking about that video, I said I uh, freeze my chocolate milk so that it doesn't be too icy when I make the smoothie. So that's what that is in here. But it's all closed up. I just dumped it in through this little spout. Nothing spilled. I thought that was so, so practical. If you guys tried the bourbon chicken in the Minute Maid rice, let me know in the comments. All right, let's move on to the bathroom stuff, the bathroom type stuff. As you know, as you've probably seen in other hauls, Bolero has got some new bath bombs, some new scents. I love bath bombs. I ran out um, a long time ago, so I grabbed some more. This one is Sweet Sleep Lavender Oil and Vanilla Bath Bombs by Bolero. And it is three in a pack. Look at that. That's the lavender lavender oil and vanilla you can smell it on the bottom there's a hole in the bottom it smells so good bolero also had pineapple and coconut bath bombs and when i do my re product review on some things i will let you guys know if this actually felt good and smelled good in the tub and they also had rose petal and honey those I thought were such really good scents I had to show y'all. They also had some new face masks by Valero. Strawberry seed facial mask with super berry extra clear. 
I just thought, well, this is kind of cool. You know, you just clean your face and put the mask on. And I love facial masks. I will, I will be redoing, doing a new review on facial masks as well for all these Bolero ones. I did it about a year ago, but it wasn't Bolero. It was just um, other kinds of face masks. And I did a whole review. If you want to see that, just go to my playlist. Um, they had the banana facial mask with vitamin E. Get glowing. I thought that one was kind of cool. And Freeman. This one's by Freeman. Feeling beautiful, deep cleaning seaweed and plus sea salt, mud mask and scrub. So this is a mud mask and scrub, which I thought was pretty cool. And if you've tried any of these, let me know. These are all new. Um, another thing that Bolero had for the bathroom is um, Gentile Body Wash. This one is fresh watermelon. And it's so big. I was like, oh, this is cool. 10 ounces. So this is watermelon. And they also had, and it's concentrate, concentrated two times, tropical pineapple. 10 ounce bottle. Tropical pineapple and watermelon. You can't beat that. <laughs> and also... I got myself some new facial masks because I got all these new masks. I needed some sponges. So I got, I just grabbed a couple of sponge by Spa April. Alrighty. And a couple of new things that I found that I hadn't seen before is fashion tape. You know how with women, sometimes if you have a shirt that's a little bit revealing on your breast section, it may come, you don't want it to come off right here. Well, the celebrities always use tape. And this is a 14-piece fashion tape by Sassy Chic. And I had never seen this before, so I thought that was really cool. And that's how you do it. It shows you right on the back. All you do is tape. It's a double-sided tape, and you tape it, and your shirt won't, you know, expose you. I thought that was really cool because these are about 2 $3 at Walmart. And I will do a review and let you know if it's even worth it. They also got the... Bra Converting Clips, two-piece by Sassy and Chic. These are really good, no matter what size you are. But if you're a size D or, or, or bigger, you might want to use both of these. And then adjust it. It pulls it tight and pulls you up and keeps you lifted. I always did like these. But these were like $2 um, other places. So for a dollar, you get two. They also have these disposable covers. It's a six-pack. These are usually 3 or $4 at any other store by Sassy Chic. And this one is to cover up your girls, your, your girls, your girls. <laughs> you don't want them things poking out. So that's what this is. I thought that was really cute that they even have that. So this keeps it so nothing's coming through your shirt. If you have a sheer shirt on or a thin shirt, you don't want your girlies poking out. So this will help with that. For those who don't know what that is, here's the direction. I really thought this was interesting. Six pieces? You can't beat that. And then they have another type of cover. If you don't want that one, they have the clear one. And it sticks right on. And you can put your shirts on and not have to worry about anything sticking out of there. I thought that was really cool, too. Now, this is something I found for the bedroom. And I thought these were really, really cool. These are satin pillowcases. Now... Everybody, no matter what your nationality is, you shouldn't be sleeping on these cotton pillowcases because it'll rub on your hair and make your hair thin and you don't want that. It should always be a satin pillowcase. And typically, satin pillowcases are pretty expensive. Well, they sell them now in the Dollar Tree. So, and it's two in a pack. And this one is a satin pillowcase by Home Collection. And let me tell you, it's a really good deal for a dollar. And look how cute this one is. You guys are not going to believe how cute this is. Look at this one says. So now when you lay on your pillow, it's not rubbing all your hair off. It's slippery. It's a little bit more slidey. It doesn't grip your hair. So keep that in mind. Everybody should be doing it. All women. I don't care what your nationality is. All right. So this one says, and these are really cute. This one says, sweet dreams. Woo! Now, is that not the most adorable thing you have ever seen? Sweet dreams. 
And if you're a crafty person and you know how to do a DIY with this, let me know. Let me know what you would do with this as a DIY. Maybe you can cut the letters and do something different with it. You don't have to use it as a pillowcase, but for me, because I know the other pillowcases are not good for my hair, I decided to get me a couple of these. So this one, this one is Sweet Dream. This one, let me show you what this one says. This one says, I got another one. This one says, good night. And pay attention to the eyelashes on the good. Look at how cute that is. Good night. Oh my God, these are great. Look at the eyelashes. The best. Satin pillowcase. This is such good quality. The materials is good. The, the lettering. This is such a good deal. If you see these at your Dollar Tree, you really should snatch it up. You cannot beat this for a dollar, okay? And I have one more pillowcase. And this one says, good morning. I won't take it out because I'll probably give one of these to my daughter. But it does say good morning, and it looks just like that. So I got good night, good morning, and sweet dreams for a dollar. <laughs> I'm excited, super excited about that. And I grabbed a couple more pair of socks. I thought these polka dots was really cute. It's a two pack. So this is what it looks like. Really good. Dollar Tree also sells face masks. So I got face masks. It is two in a pack. You know, and it just clips right, right, right back there. I just thought that was cool that they even sell them. Um... Oh, look what else I found that was very different. Reflective safety vest. It's the glow-in-the-dark glow vest that people use when they work on the streets, you know, construction workers. I thought for a dollar there might be a DIY that can be done with this. Has anybody seen this? I thought this was really cool. Let's see what it looks like. I'm going to open it, you guys, so you can see it. All right, let's take it out. It's a really neon, I love it, it's sheer, you see it is sheer, it's sheer, you can see. But this might make also, and it has a strip, so if you're on your bike, this is something you might want to use so that the cars can see you, and the strip goes all the way around the back. So if you're a night bike rider, or if you're a worker out in, you know, out in the streets or whatever, or if you're out at night in general, Wear this neon. Look at I don't know if y'all can see the neon on this thing, but it is seriously, seriously neon. I thought that was so cool. If you've seen this, you guys seen this, let me know if you haven't. Let me know in the comments. But I thought this was really good, especially because I want to get take a bike ride in when we find a house. All right, now for um, like a home decor type of thing. I did find the floating shelves. These would usually be about $3, so I was super excited to find this shelf. Here's the floating shelf, and that's what it would look like when it's hanging up, right there. And it comes with the equipment, as you can see. It's just a small shelf, but you put it like this. And for instance, like I could set one of my, you see I got one of my, let me show you. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I don't want to get it, I don't want to get it because I got my mic on, but I got two of them. So this will be in my bedroom when we move into our house. I just thought that was super cute. Where did you guys put? Or you can put it in the bathroom or you can put, I want to put one of my black figurines. I have figurines all over the house. So they'll probably sit on top of the shelf. I was super excited about that. Now, I don't know if you guys know, but today is my birthday. Whoop, whoop. I am a cancer, honey. But... I found a cute, cute candle. It sings happy birthday. It's four candles and one musical holder. And so I just thought that was super cute. Look at that. This sings happy birthday. <laughs> Who knew? <laughs> All right. If you remember my last haul, I showed that big um, cross with the lights on it. Well, this is the tape by the same person who made that, Marquee, Marquee Love. This is the tape she also has. It's by Marky Love. And you can use this and decorate the letter, the um, the big cross that I showed in the last haul. I'll try to stick that somewhere. You can decorate it with these. And I just thought that this gold was really, really pretty. 
to do to decorate my light up thing. I got this little 3D sticker bag, anti coagulant um, sachet. I just thought this was cute. It's in a mason jar with a bunch of stickers in it. Let me show y'all what this uh, what this thing is. I just thought it was cute. See, here goes the little stickers in there. You can hold, you can put anything if you have beads, you know, whatever whatever it is that you want to put in here. But it's just a cute way to, to, to hold something that you have. And see, it's got a bunch of little hearts, little stars, actually. And they say something. It says, chill out. And they all say something different. So basically, this is a, a sachet to hold anything small. So that, you know, it just be a cute way to hold it. So if you got beads, you got little letters or something you want, you need some way to put it. Good, good idea. As you know, I've grabbed plenty of trivia games from the Dollar Tree. I think last time I showed y'all, I grabbed um, Wheel of Fortune. I put this up a few hauls back, but I wanted to show it again because look what I found on this one. Jeopardy! Ooh. So I'm so excited about this. When I do my lives, I like to play trivia. Actually, I'll probably do a live today. <laughs> so now I have this and I have Wheel of Fortune. And I just thought that was really cool. If anybody else has these games, let me know. Almost done. I got a cute, cute notepad. Look at the panda bears inside of the, the little um, cupcake cup. And it's just lined paper. But I just thought the panda bears in there was super cute with the ring, ring binder. Oh, and for you people that have kids, this reminds me, I can't remember if it's when my kids were young or when my grandkids was, when my granddaughter was young. But them Angry Birds were so popular back then. And when I seen these, um, a these Angry Bird grab bags, I just thought it was cute. Now, my, gra my granddaughters are all girls, so I don't know if they would be into it, but I have a lot of nephews that are little great nephews that might like it. I found one of the Angry Birds. That's one. That's red. Now, if you watch Angry Birds, you know who that is. I don't know why I had to pick these up because I just thought it was the cutest thing ever. And then I found Bomb from Angry Birds. Look at that. Oh, my God. So Bomb in red. And they had a bunch of the other characters from Angry Birds. So if your kid watched that show, I'm sure you know what I'm talking about. And I found this really cool, cool light, LED project projector light. So it takes two AA batteries. I think it's AA. Let me double check. Yes, two AAA batteries, which I always have batteries in my house because I buy them at the Dollar Tree. And it projects on the ceiling. I just thought that was super cute. I got a new, uh, like a five-month-old granddaughter, so putting this on might really attract her attention. You see how right here? It's a projector. It's like having a, a movie theater in your room, except for it projects right there. I thought that was cute. So that this one's purple. They had blue. They had red. They had all kinds. If your kids have tried this, let me know. And see, here's the back with the on and off switch. And you can clip it if you want to or whatever. And then on the top is where the projector part is. Right there. Just like a projection. So cool. And the last couple of things I got. I found these cute gold letters. Because as you know, I like black and gold. I like yellow. I like all different kinds of colors. But I just thought these, these letters were really cute. And I'll find something to do with it. It is gold letters. You can see them, they're bedazzled a little bit. I got two packs. And then I figure I'm going to use them on these poster boards. And it's all different colors. You see? Pink, green, orange, and yellow. Can you see that? Pink, green, orange, and yellow. Poster board. So maybe putting uh, my name on here, like subscribe, comment, share, or something like that. I thought that would be kind of cute. I'm going to do that sometime today. And I think that is it. Oh, one last thing. Cleaning products. 
that I wanted to show you guys by Ajax. You know Ajax is not name brand, but this one is a multi-purpose cleaner. And this kind is, I don't know, green apple, lemon or lime or something. That's by Ajax. Let me see how big it is. Lime with baking soda, and it is 16.9 ounces. Lime with baking soda. Cleaning. It's to multi-purpose cleaning. And I don't know if I knew Ajax for cleaning products. I know they have the dish detergent, but I thought this was different. And they also have orange multi-purpose cleaner. So I got both. If you've seen these and use these, let me know. This one is orange. Oh, it smells good, too. It's really strong. Wow. So you put this in a mop bucket, and you're going to be good to go. Mmm. Okay, Ajax. Come on. <laughs> All right. So I think that's it. I got everything I wanted to show y'all. This is a quick 20-minute video. I hope you watched to the end. Thank you very much for stopping by. Like I said, please join my family. Hit the, hit the bell. Hit the subscribe button. All my information is in the description box. You can run my playlist. Follow me on Instagram. That's in the description box as well. My email. All ways to reach me if you need me. Thank you for coming by, and I hope you guys have a blessed day. Bye.